The evening rush in Northern Virginia and the tolls for solo drivers are ticking higher, starting at $2 for the nine mile stretch on I 66, then climbing as the traffic builds to $12, 23, 34, even 40. Yeah, that's way too expensive. It's called dynamic pricing. Every six minutes, the tolls fluctuate based on traffic volume. In the first week, travel times were cut in half as more people chose carpools or mass transit. In fact, just 28 drivers chose to pay $40 during one morning peak. The average round trip toll, $14. This is how it's supposed to work. When it's getting too congested, they don't want you on the roads. Nationwide, 86% of commuters drive to work, three quarters of them solo. Dynamic tolling started 20 years ago in California and has since spread to 40 roads in 11 states and territories as DOTs try to reduce congestion and also pay for road and bridge repairs. But they're just charging more money to use the old roads. I thought that's why we pay separate taxes. I-66 continuing at least as far west as Manassas and Haymarket. Bob Marburg has been covering D.C. area traffic for 38 years on WTOP radio. We certainly are maxing out and we certainly are wearing out the infrastructure. But if we don't pay to maintain what we have, there will come a day when we won't have it. So now on I-66, rush hour drivers are paying for the luxury of going solo. Tom Costello, NBC News, Arlington, Virginia. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.